Hey, it's me, Frank. It's me, Hank. And me, George. We'll be talking about the trifecta of bullying today. So each of us are going to cover one of the three corners of the trifecta of bullying. So to start it off, we have the antagonist. The antagonist is actually the person who initiates the bullying, usually calls the person a name or just something of that sort. So the next person we have on the trifecta is the victim. The victim is usually the one receiving the negativity from the antagonist and he is usually the one who is hurt. And so the last person we want to cover today is the bystander, who in many situations is considered just as bad as the antagonist. Okay, so just getting out of the nitty gritty, we're actually going to be teaching you how to prevent a bully. And George here is actually going to be the victim, and I'm once again going to be the antagonist. So in this example, this is how you do not prevent a bully. This is what you do not want to do. So George, um, I think your shoes look dumb. No, they don't. Your shoes are dumb. I don't like that thing on your shirt. Well, it's the same one as you have. Yeah, but mine's cooler. And all I did was stand there and watch. So, now that we've gone through how not to deal with a bully, we're going to teach you a little bit with how to deal with a bully. So, George, I think your shoes look dumb. Really? I quite like them, and I like yours too. Yeah, but mine are cooler and yours are dumb. That's really good. Yeah, and that, that thing on your shirt, I don't like it either. That's the same one as you have, except yours looks better. Um, I don't like the way you did your hair today. Really? Yours looks really good today. I'm speechless. So George, I think your shoes look dumb. Hey! Just because you don't like something about him doesn't mean you need to point him out. Let him be his own person. What's your problem? I mean, I guess I'm just insecure about my own shoes. Hey, honestly, we're here for you. Yeah. Thanks. Well, I'm Frank. And I'm Hank. And I'm George. Signing off.